Alright, here we go. Macho Grubba. Not as cool of a boss name. Macho! I'm a powerhouse now, you pester little pieces of prairie people. Alright. Let's go ahead and rock him. Whoa, look at that. Alright, so unfortunately he doesn't have as cool of a boss theme as, you know, Rock Hawk, excuse me. Um, I think that also might be a... Alright, so he doesn't have a defense point, which is good. Uh, I guess I'll stick with, uh, with a uh, scrap for now. Honestly, I don't really see much... Okay, he does damage. He's doing damage and he does a good amount of it, so I'll just stick with him. And... More chances to attack are now available. That means that now he gets to go twice each turn. So you want to watch out for that. Bad. Alright. This shouldn't be too hard, actually. He seems to... He looks like he's got a lot of HP, and he seems kind of scary because he gets to attack twice a turn, though, but really, there's not too many ways he can surprise you. Well... Okay. Ha ha ha, he's still calling us Gonzalez. And what do we got? Raise his attack by three. And... Here we go. Watch out. Ooh, six. That's a lot. Um... Alright, so now he's no longer got his attack boosted. So, that's what he likes to do. He likes to boost his attack, and then on the same turn, follow up with, uh... With, uh... Jeez. Uh... With a strong attack like that. See, like that. Now he's boosting his defense. And... What's he doing now? He's gonna attack us. Alright. It's kind of a good idea to have Koops in this match, too, I guess, because, uh, you know, higher defense and all. Uh, he's got three defense, though, so we're not going to be doing much to him. I guess, uh, I can go ahead and try... I'll go ahead and just try my hammer. Only one damage, though, but whatever. His defense will go down soon enough. Next turn, actually. Shell Shield might not be too bad in this match if he's raising his attack a lot, though, but I don't really think I need it. Alright, and here we go with the attack. Hopefully it'll hit Koops. Alright, not bad. And he jumped three times. <laughs> Stupid x knots would you not throw rocks at us when we're trying to do important fights? This doesn't even concern you. Eh, whatever. Let's go ahead and just power bounce him. Alright, this actually isn't too hard of a fight. I know I shouldn't jinx it, but whatever. Okay. Oh, God. Back oh, wow. They had to make some of his moves illegal back in the day. Whoa! That's a new one. And he now gets more chances to attack next turn. Um, let's go and see if we can do clock out on him, see if it works. Because that might not be a bad idea right now. didn't freeze him in time. Of course not. Of course it didn't freeze him in time. That would just make too much sense for us. Eh, well. I guess I can always try Earth Tremoring him in a bit. And now he's dodgy. That's... That's wonderful. Yeah, really great. Oh! Freaking x knots Jeez. Wish they'd quit freaking trying to you know, hit us with rocks. Oh, if it isn't the x knots with the rocks and the throw on, like a Geodude, and, oh, I don't know what I'm talking about. Oh, I hope you know what I'm talking about, because I don't know what I'm talking about. Ah, gee, he hasn't even attacked Mario once yet. At least not hit Mario once. Wow, I thought for sure I was going to jinx that there, but I didn't. Let's go ahead, boom, 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 boom. Boom. Okay. He's got 10 HP left. Come on. Not bad. Ah, I ain't finished yet, Gonzalez. Ain't over till it's over. That's the way it goes in combat sports, son. Alright. Let's see what he's got now. If I go through this whole fight without Mario taking any damage, that'd just be amazing. Wow! He just keeps on missing. Um. Go for hammer. 
Actually, I probably should have gone for Earth Tremor there, though, but whatever. And... nah. Oh, well. And missed. Alright, whatever. And... more chance to attack are now available, but I don't care. And great! A daisy made the audience pass out. So we're now... Well, actually, it doesn't really matter if we don't get any star power now. But look at this! We beat him! Or, rather, I beat him without taking any damage! He missed every single turn! Yarg! Well, at least Mario didn't take any damage. Look at that, 30 HP. Awesome. Uh, never had that happen before. No! How'd this happen? How can a perfect bot like mine lose to such a chub? Aw. Oh. Alright. We have taken down Mr. Champion! Jolene! No, I mean, Mario. Please allow me to offer my earnest thanks for defeating that foul grubber. Mr. Jolene! I really have to apologize. I'm so sorry that I had to get you involved. But you must understand, I had to learn the truth about the arena by any means. Let me tell you everything. I had a little brother once by the name of Mush. He'd done everything for me. Our family was always poor, so he became a fighter here to support us all. But he suddenly went missing one day. Our family was inconsolable. I suspected foul play, so I got hired on as a manager and investigated in secret. I looked for clues about my brother. I accidentally saw Mr. Grubba transform. Seeing what I was up against, I almost gave up hope. And then you appeared. So I decided to secretly guide you. Oh, so you're our mysterious ex. Correct. It was me. Once I saw you fight, I knew you were the only one who could challenge Grubba. Aww. Look at how pathetic he is now. Now, sir. No, not sir. Grubba. I want answers right now. What'd you do to my precious little brother? You know exactly what I'm talking about. The first champion, Prince Mush. Mush? Uh, Prince Mush, he, he discovered the secret of my power-sucking machine. I had him uh, disappear. Any which way we look at it, oh, he ain't around these parts no more. No! I, I suspected as much. Oh, poor sweet Mush. Gee, she seemed kind of aloof, but she really just loved her brother. Hey, Mario, look up there, the crystal star! Ooh. It's Mush! Wow, look at the family resemblance, the exact same hair and everything. Look, he's pink! Whoa, is this... am I back in the glitz pit? Mush! Oh, is that you, sis? What are you doing here? I... I was... I was just... There, there, Mush. It's okay. It's all over. Finally. So the Crystal Stars brought him back? I guess they do have the power to bring people back to life, whatever. Just like the Dragon Balls! Now, Mario, the Crystal Star is yours. Alright. Here we go. His machine is powered down. Here we go. Yep, it's better off that we have it, so nothing like this will ever happen again, I guess. Here we go! It's time for the A Famous! You got a crystal star! Your star power is now forward. Mario learned the special move Power Lift! Nice! End of chapter! Glitzville's seamy underside was a dark, dangerous place, seething with conspiracy. With the help of the lovely Miss Jolene, Mario revealed Grubba's true identity and acquired the third Crystal Star by defeating the monstrous Macho Grubba. Grubba had used the power of the Crystal Star to run his power draining machine. What other hidden powers might these strange and mystical items possess? Alright, we're done with this chapter. And now on to two very pointless interludes.